are tracking a string of home invasions near U of M. Yeah, police believe the same guy is responsible for all of these invasions. Seven Action News reporter Amira, da Amira David joins us now live with that story. Amira. That's right. Right now I am at Packard and Division. I want to give you a sense of where this is located. As you can see right across the street, you've got the University of Michigan campus. But if you just peer around here, Right over here, you have student housing all around this block on every which way. You have rows of homes, and this is exactly the area that was targeted. We are told the perpetrator walked in here, doors unlocked, and the most unnerving part is certainly that students were reportedly inside at the time. Now, we want to give you a more specific look at where all of this went down. We're talking about, again, four different incidents over the last two days, the 500 block of Hill Street, the 700 block of Division, the 300 block of Packer, Again, authorities say the perpetrator walked right into these homes. No forced entry whatsoever, stole cash and valuables. We've been talking to students who live in the area, and one of them tells us he's really alarmed to hear the news, especially because he often leaves his own door unlocked. We leave our home open a lot because uh, I have eight people who live in this house. So, you know, um, it's like people are going in and out all day. And as you heard there, it's really a matter of convenience. Lots of these homes are shared by multiple students and they want the convenience of going in and out. But police say today that students really need to have their guard up. They need to follow uh, important precautions. They need to lock their doors and take security very seriously. And as you mentioned, that suspect is still at large. I want to give you a quick description. Uh, he is being described as a black man around six feet tall, 250 pounds, around 40 to 50 years of age. And they are saying if you know anything about about this person or his whereabouts to contact either the University of Michigan campus police or the Ann Arbor police in Ann Arbor. Amira David, 7 Action News.